Hey guys, Joe Outdoors here. Today I'm back with another fishing video. And today I'm going to be targeting two different species that I've never fished for before, which are chain pickerel and smallmouth bass. So, um, today I'm just going to put on a little frog. So I'm going to start off with. And there's a bunch of weeds over there, so I'm going to throw into the weeds and see if some will be in there, and hopefully there will be, because I'd like to catch a new species, because I love doing that, but I'm going to go ahead and start fishing now and see if I can get any. So I'm at my spot, and I see a really nice spot. There's a bunch of trees over there, and there might be fish hiding underneath it and in that tall grass, so that's where I'm going to throw my frog into, and hopefully there'll be fish in there. So I'm switching it up. I uh, put this on. And I'm going to throw out here and see if I can get one with this. So we fished here for a little bit and dad had one just blow up on his fish. So I saw it when I was just turned my head, I saw it blow up. It was pretty cool. He didn't get it, but it was really close to the shore there. But we're going to move on now, find a new place. And there looks to be some more promising places that we saw. So we're going to head there and see if we can get any there. Okay, so we're at another spot and... I'm going to start off with just a little swim bait for now, and if I start getting weeds, I'm going to throw the frog back on, but I'm going to fish out a little bit, and there seems to be a lot of cover here, so that's pretty good, so I'm going to start fishing it and see if I can get any. So I'm at this new spot here and this spot looks really good. There's tons of grass in this uh, lake. So I'm going to start off with my frog and I'm going to throw the frog into the grass and see if I can get any. Fish on. Oh, that was really cool. I don't know what that was, but first cast, some took it right there. I might not have set the hook good enough, but the, the hooks are in the frog's back. So I'm gonna throw it there again and see if I can get them. Dad's got one on over here. Looks like it's a bass that jumped right out of the water. Oh, 
Oh, came off. So what are you using? Nice. That's a big guy. Yeah. It's all barbless. Right? Yeah, he jumped to the water a couple times. So we're going to keep on fishing and hopefully we have more luck. So right now I'm walking to find another spot and I'm in this tall grass and there's a lot of water. I've seen a few frogs so that's pretty good to see since I have the frog on right now. And there's a, a lot of grass over here so I'm going to go and try to fish that with the frog. Hopefully I can have another one come after it. So I made it to my spot. There's tons of grass out here in the water, so plenty of potential for bass and chain pickerel, so I'm going to go ahead and start throwing. Oh my goodness, that was a big chain pickerel. Right there, just had a big chain pickerel on the frog. That was really cool. So I'm not gonna throw right back there yet. I'm gonna throw out there, cause I had another one out there, and one right there. That was a huge chain pickerel, whew. I really hope I catch him. There's my frog. So I'm gonna throw out that way now and in a minute, I'll throw it back there. There's one. This guy's a small one. Oh, he's gone. So that was a small chain pickerel. Hopefully you saw that on camera, but that's pretty cool. I'm glad to catch one. So that was on the frog. I'm gonna keep throwing the frog. That was a different one that took last time, but just a little bit over. So I'm gonna keep fishing around the same spots and hopefully I get the big one again.
Dad's got one here. Looks like it might be a uh, chain pickerel, but pickerel. Nice little small one. There he goes. So I'm at another spot here, and um, I'm on the dam. I see one blow up on something out here, so I'm gonna cast at it. There's another one, something blew up over there. Dad's got a fish over here. Another one. Oh, it's a nice pickerel. Another one just rolled when he had this one on. Oh yeah, look at that. So he's using a lizard now, a white lizard. He won't let go. There he goes. Look at them over there. I think I might throw a couple here. Dad's got another one. That lizard seems to be working really good. Let's check out the teeth on these. Wow, sharp. So there he goes. Hopefully I can get one next, but that's what fishing's all about. Just gotta keep trying. So I'm at this new spot that I haven't fished yet. It's below the dam. I've seen a lot of fish blowing up out here, so I'm gonna try it, see if I can get any fish. So I fished over here and dad caught a few over here. I'm gonna go back to that big rock that I was at where I caught those, where I hooked those uh, chain pickerel. And I'm gonna see if I can get that big guy again. They should be all calmed down now. So I'm gonna go and see if I can get them. So dad's got another one on. Another little small one. There he is. So this time he has a pearl fish on. Yeah. 
so we fished this spot. I didn't make it back to that big rock. But we're going to go check out uh, another lake like this one. And see if we can catch some fish there. Dad had a smallmouth bass on right at the beginning. I was hoping that we were going to catch a whole bunch of them. But we didn't catch a whole bunch of them. Hopefully the next spot we can get one. So we didn't end up going to the, the other lake. We couldn't find it. So I'm back at the campground now and I had lots of fun on this trip. We we went fishing tonight, it was lots of fun. First time ever going pickerel and smallmouth bass fishing. So we caught, our dad had two smallmouth bass on and we got a bunch of chain pickerel. I think dad got a lot of chain, more chain pickerel than me on the, the lizard he had. So if you guys liked today's video, Press the like button, and if you're new, subscribe, and don't forget to comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video.